Yo, what is going on YouTube? How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Yo, as you guys can know, today, well this week is actually Thanksgiving week. So this whole week, of course, or each and every single day, of course, we gotta be thankful guys, you know, for the stuff that we do have. Um, instead of thinking, of course, of the stuff that we don't have at the moment or the stuff that we actually do want, you know, just be thankful for the stuff that we actually do have right now at the moment. Me personally, that I'm still actually here to this very day from all the stuff that has happened to me in the last, uh, last couple of months or so. 2020 has been, it's been definitely, definitely a crazy, uh, crazy year for all of us, you know, so we just got to stay positive, do what we got to do. And I'm still going to be posting these videos for you guys each and every single day. So let's so let's get right into it, guys. All right. So don't go back to your ex-girlfriend. Now, many of you guys might be actually asking yourself or thinking to yourself, why is she uh, thinking of me or is she even thinking of me or is she actually does she want to be back with me or so? And honestly, guys, you guys should not be thinking like that. I had the actual same perspective or the same actual thoughts when it came to actually me and the previous ex-girlfriend that I had previously before, um, where everything was going A-OK, -okay, everything was going perfect, you know, uh, just like how you see in the movies, the next thing or nowhere, you know, boom, it actually just goes all downhill from there on. And just to let you guys know, of course, even though, of course, I would feel like us, most guys, we actually put all of our effort in relationships or so on. For whatever reason, if they don't work, if they don't work, then they do not work. And just to let you guys know, it, it was not your fault. It is not you. It is her. Most of these women nowadays, of course, for whatever reason, they just play either games or they actually just love to play games to see, of course, what guy they could either tie down just play with their heart and then just throw them, throw them to the side and then just leave them like that. But the reason why I say it says don't go back to your ex is, is because the whole reason of you uh, not going back to your ex is so they so she could actually see that you're actually uh, an actual strong individual that of course is not going to go back to them regardless of the whole situation. Because if you do try to go back to them or if you let's just say that um, she hits you up or you hit them back up, and then she actually, you guys are trying to start things all over again, but you actually are the one that initiated the whole um, talking back, talking again, trying to see if, it, if things actually do work out or so in this case. And trust me, guys, she is going to see you as a lower value guy instead of the actual high value guy that she previously saw you before. And trust me, she is going to lose interest more or she has already lost a little bit of interest in you in regards of you actually being this, of you actually not wanting to actually seek out other options and other actual women out there. Because honestly, guys, there are more women out there than there are men. And that, of course, is for a reason. Us guys, we could actually not we're not actually supposed to stay here in that same position because once we actually do decide to do that or once we actually do hit them back up they are going to be the one that are in the control they are going to be the one that, that actually has all the power they are going to be the ones that i can like literally do whatever they want and get away with it or so in this case now regardless of the whole situation whatever actually did happen between both of you guys honestly it is what it is, is, is one of my phrases. Things happen for a reason, guys. So you guys gotta, gotta actually know that you guys actually gotta let it know, but guys do not go back to your ex. That's a big no-no from there. That's like an X sign. That's an X sign, you guys cut that off immediately. Cut that off immediately. If you guys aren't together as of right now, as of this moment, then it actually is meant for a reason, guys. You guys gotta actually focus on yourself, worry about stuff that honestly do matter in your life. Um, if you guys, of course, are trying to get that new promotion, trying to get a new job or not, just uh, focus on yourself. Just doing what you guys got to do, of course, and just not worried about these women, guys. Like one thing, of course, that I feel like, of course, that I that me previously before that I have done before that I am guilty of is focusing all my actual actions on women instead of me actually focusing on my goals that I personally have for myself in regards to uh, either going to the gym 
doing better at work or I'm not since of course I do have a sales position trying to get this actual uh, commission that I actually are and wanted to get her so you know little little goals like that of course that actually do help out in the long run or so and honestly it's the case and honestly in this particular case like I'm saying guys this is the main reason as to why you guys cannot go back to your actual ex-girlfriend and why you guys shouldn't ever go back to your ex-girlfriend and just for the fact that you guys are actually better than this. You guys are actually better than that. You guys are a heart or a high value male. Now, of course, if you guys do decide to go back with your ex, trust me, guys, she is either going to leave you quicker than she actually has ever thought about leaving you. And then most of the times, whenever she actually does leave you in the first place, within weeks before she does even leave you, women are never going to be alone by themselves or she's not going to leave you and she's not going to be okay well i don't have no options left no she is gonna have a specific guy that she actually is looking at and then once she actually does leave you she's gonna monkey branch onto the next guy from there on out of course or the next guy that she's actually talking to or the next guy that she's actually thinking about or wanting to be with herself this actually has happened previously before to my ex well we and my ex-girlfriend or so well i really can't confirm that actually did happen but what i can confirm is that most of these women are like that that's why they actually of course are all emotional they actually have, have think about all this stuff that actually of course that actually goes on in their day-to-day -day life or so in this case guys and i'm telling you guys you guys should never go back to your ex-girlfriend because honestly um, if you guys do more than half of the time, the second time you guys actually do try to work things out, it's still not going to work out or it actually does have an actual lower rate of it actually working even out in the first place, guys. So guys, focus on yourself do what you guys got to do as far as, uh, bettering yourself each and every single day to because of be, to become the best version of yourself and honestly me personally for me regardless with the situation that i'm currently in, in as of right now i may have a broken leg guys but i'm still doing these videos for you guys each and every single day i feel motivated guys i feel motivated to 2020 honestly regardless of, of it actually being a, a crazy year i'm still motivated to make these videos for you guys and honestly and on top of that um I'm gonna start working out, you know. I'm gonna start like literally just doing regular stuff that I could be doing. I would say just like push-ups or uh, or possibly sit-ups or so. I ha have no idea. However, that actually may work out or so. Even though with this actual leg that is recovering right now, and trust me, guys, do not go back to your ex-girlfriend. Don't text them back. Don't do anything like that at all. Because once you actually do go back to them, they're gonna see you as a weaker guy, as a guy that wasn't able to actually resist or so. A guy that didn't have no options or anything like that at all. A guy that honestly didn't have no purpose in life or didn't have nothing going on for themselves or so in this case and that's about it guys so if you guys did like as of today's video i do appreciate you guys watching my video as of today uh hey make sure to actually hit the like down below of course any questions any comments that you guys do have in the comment down below in the comment section also if you guys want to catch me on my social media you guys can definitely do so i am at jrico92 on instagram other than that, here for you guys. You guys subscribe to my YouTube channel. 